Hi guys, welcome back to the channel, Rod's Keto Cafe. I thought these uh, muffins, blueberry muffins, look absolutely delicious. Well, I decided to try a recipe from Low Carb Recipes with Jennifer, and she made these blueberry muffins using yogurt, and uh, that was the secret ingredients that I, I use. Anyhow, to, be, to get this uh, recipe, we used two and a half cups of almond flour, one tablespoon of baking soda, a fourth of a teaspoon of salt, a half of a cup of granulated sugar, and then we used three large eggs, eight ounces of yogurt now she said greek yogurt but i couldn't find any that day i bought that so i got the store brand and i used two teaspoons of vanilla extract and one cup of blueberries and uh now what i'm doing is i'm popping one of those babies out and uh they, oh yeah so when i baked them i baked them at 400 degrees for uh 20 to 25 minutes because they were large muffins her original recipe said 15 to 18 minutes, and she used uh, small ones. In her recipe, they made 12, and my, I made six big ones on mine with the silicone mat. And uh, there you have the uh, muffin that just came out of the uh, uh, silicone um, muffin holder, and uh, the, I got that muffin holder on Amazon where you get most of my stuff, and I can't find it at Walmart's or Target's or even Kohl's and the other stores that I go to all the time. And then what I did after that, I took a little bit of butter and then I, uh, you know, cause, cause you know, everything tastes good with butter. And uh, so this this was so, that was just probably the, the, the best uh, recipe that I made to date. And uh, Jennifer said that you can also take the, uh, this particular recipe and use this for a base recipe now. Well, how she, what she recommends is that you can, um, you know, you can use uh, this for like uh, strawberry muffins, peach muffins, pineapple muffins. Uh, you know, you, you can put just you, you can figure out. You can just about use your imagination on that. And then I'm taking a little slab of tablespoon of butter. These are these are at, at this point they just came out of the oven and it was still nice and warm. And I was trying to get a, a good thumbnail for the photograph for my uh, YouTube channel, Ron's Keto Cafe. Now I've been putting these. Uh, recipes together like this now with the voiceover and some subtle background music because the noise level in my apartment is horrendous and uh, there you go there you have the final product and uh, now I suppose you want me to take a uh, little bit of a taste test with these uh, and, and and again uh, you know like looking at the, the butter is melting right into the uh, muffin itself these are so good I, I ended up eating two of these that, that, when I made these and uh, look at that guys huh Look at that. Just be careful with the blueberries because the blueberries do stain, you know, but uh, they were really good. I mean, you know, for, for the what you'd spend in the store for muffins and getting all that sugar crap, this is the next best option. And again, I give myself a thumbs up and uh, let's go ahead and support Jennifer by going over to her channel and subscribe to her channel as well as my channel. And just thank you guys for coming along my journey. So without further ado and all that jibber jat, why don't we go right into the recipe. And from this point on, it'll just be music and directions over the timeline. And have a great day. And don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to my channel. Thank you.
Well, uh, muffins are done. They just came out of the oven. So I checked them at the halfway point and I needed to put them back in for another 10 minutes because I forgot that these were large uh, blueberry muffins. And I'm um, just taking it out of the uh, mold. And uh, these came out absolutely fantastic. Uh, these were the best muffins I ever made by far. And again, don't forget to go over there and like and support Jennifer's channel as well as mine and many other YouTubers that you follow that we put these uh, terrific videos for you to, to enjoy. Uh, these take a tremendous amount of time to, uh, not so much to film, but to edit the video and uh, if, if you want to put it together properly for people to enjoy. And at this point, I'm just cutting my muffin in half a little bit in quarters and I'm just taking a slab of a tablespoon of butter and I use the uh, Kerrygold butter, by the way. And what I'm doing right now is I'm just trying to put the uh, muffin pack together again so I can have, I just can't wait to try, dive into this and have a taste test to see what it tastes like. And as far as the sugar that I use, I use Lankento uh, Microfruit Sweetener. That's her choice of uh, regular uh, sweetener that I use, and that's my choice as well. And that's what I put in my coffee in the morning, and there you have our final product. And yeah, look at that nice butter melted. Now, if you were to go to a regular coffee shop, you'd be paying about 5 to $6 right now for muffins and another three or four cups of coffee. Why not just make that in your house and have it in your favorite cup of coffee or morning beverage? Look at that. Didn't that come out really good? Great, guys. And again, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to my channel and support Jennifer's channel by going over there and saying, hey, I saw this video that Ron did, and, uh, you know, and I enjoy your video as well as his, and, you know, that really helps us out there. And I'm going to give it a thumbs up and, uh, you know, definitely uh, be making this again, and now, now, you know, trying to get a good thumb up there, as you can see from the YouTube channel. But, uh, you know, I'm, I'm definitely getting better at the recipe filming and uh, talking over the timeline now because it's crazy and the noise here. But I'm definitely going to start doing some live videos, so just hang on. Again, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to the channel. Love you guys. I forgot to mention, thanks for watching.